Hello and welcome to an episode of the Russellverse. Here we have Gunther against L. A. Knight. Alright, and I'll do the storyline. Yeah, there's some storylines for this match that won't be said till we get into the ring hello and welcome to Wrestlemania 40 in Philadelphia Pennsylvania comes the challenger of Gunther L A Knight the man who uh, who the crowd adore a man who has respect from almost everyone a man who's able to talk the talk walk the walk he's able to do it all And he gets his chance at Gunther. You may notice no Giovanni Vinci at ringside tonight. That is because this man defending himself. Giovanni was trying to attack him, but he dodged. Giovanni ran straight into that barricade, and he ran leg first. And um, he has an injured knee, so he will not be here tonight. But here is Ludwig Kaiser. The music begins. In the shadow, you see a figure of strength of dominance as Gunter's Intercontinental Championship reign. Has lasted. Since around this time last year, a full year of dominance. Not this year. I'm not last year, but two years ago. As the ring general prepares to show unbridled dominance and no remorse against LA Knight, but. Elena has known for this for a very long time, and he has prepared for it. Gunter has that title, but will it be for the very last time? Of course, you have to account for Kaiser in his corner. Kaiser. That's what they're fighting for. Continental gold on the line. From Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 230 pounds, LA Knights! And his opponent, from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Gold! 
A staggering presence awaits till a night here tonight. A man that has beaten on to a point of shame on many WWE superstars. Chad Gable, Ricochet, Mustafa Ali, Drew McIntyre even, Sheamus, and many more. But will LA Knight be added to that list? We'll find out tonight. And we are underway. And Knight starts it off with a DDT. One, two, Gunter kicks out. Knight already getting a two count here. So it's not something that we expected. Gunter seems a little frail after that attempted attack. And a back, but that elbow showed otherwise. But Knight, Knight, while Gunter was taunting, LA Knight rolls him up from behind. Gunter kicks out immediately. And turns around with the shot. Back suplex onto that head of and his neck going for something and Knight lands another DDT and Hunter here staggered a little he hasn't been this challenged sends him back into the ring this is the match before the main event of night one of WrestleMania 40. And LA Knight already looking for something. Gunter's legs on the outside. Could this be what I'm thinking here? Backbreak. No, it's a backbreaker. I thought he was going for an avalanche sidewalk slam, but clearly not. As he lands an elbow drop and now stomping in on that leg of his kick to the body. Knee drop from Knight. Another no. Gunter is able to Knight's able to avoid the big boot. Drops him. Knight. No. Hey, the referee's distracted. He's doing the count. But Knight lands a clothesline. Chop and a shoulder tackle. Knight. It's Gunter. Off the ropes. What a power slam. Stomp. Gunter. These two are trading. Knights had the advantage so far. But Gunter's getting him up. Quite squash into the corner. And Gunter puts Knight in a sleeper hold. He's attacking that. He's been attacking that face all night. He had, he punched Knight in the face with brass brass knuckles. Um, two Smackdowns ago, but a Knight could get the win. No, Gunter kicked out. And Knight playing possum and just and Kaiser tossed him around. German suplex on the outside. Gunther's been attacking that head and neck area. And Gunther got a little lost on what he was trying to do. Drop kick by Knight. Grabs the chair. Heads into the ring with it. Hits drop the Gunter with a drop kick. It's 
Sends him into the ring. Gets him in. And Gunter's escaped. Here are Nagi. And Gunter going for a big boot. Knight stuck under. Night taunting. Uh oh, Emerald Flosion. One, two, no. Night kicked out. And Gunter looking for something from the top. Gunter. Once night up and misses the drop kick, what a boot. Gets a chair. Rides into the ring with it. Drops it though. Think he's trying to prove to Gunther that he doesn't need to cheat to win. Oh, what a boot. No, but another double axe handle. Gunther just taunting. We're getting massive boost here. It's Gunter just laying in the night. I think that cut expanded a little. Knight struggling. I think Gunter might be looking for a power bomb. No. Gunter counter. Just tosses his knight. Knight got back up. Knight got back up. BFT one two gray and night night got it done night gets it done night is champion here's your winner and new WWE Intercontinental Gunther's reign over LA Knight is your new Undisputed Intercontinental Champion! That wasn't supposed to happen, I'm gonna be honest. So you know what? You guys deserve one more match. So that's what I'm gonna give you. And guess we'll do our wage.
Where's Kenny at? All right, you guys are getting a heater tonight. Guess the match already happened, but if it's good, why not do it twice, no? And we are live on AEW Dynamite here in Phoenix, Arizona, who will get treated to our main event tonight. It is Brian Danielson against Kenny Omega. One more time from Aberdeen. Brian Brian Danielson, leader leader of the Yes Movement. The man of the Valkyrie. The American Dragon. Dancing. Getting a mix of cheers and booze. But I think we know who the crowd were rooting for tonight. Well, at least most people. Kenny Omega is who they are rooting for. Danielson. Ready. But... He's got an opponent in the half here tonight. Here comes the best belt machine, Kenny Omega. To a roaring approval here, the former, the former AEW champion, Impact champion, Ring of Honor champion, New Japan champion. A champion of of almost every single wrestling brand that has ever existed. As Kenny gets ready to to show that he is the best belt machine, better than Danielson, best in the world. Is what he thinks he is. No elite for him tonight, but. Oh my butt. Kenny has a tough challenge in tonight. And we are underway. Omega gets him up, rolls him through already. And a kick to the face there. They're already starting off. This is gonna, both of these men have athletic talent. They have technique. But Kenny has has some power that Danielson doesn't have. Kenny looking to roll through once again. On the apron. Oh. Slap. Off the ropes. Base buster. And what a shooting star press. Kenny, a man of high wrestling talent, and he's showing it off. That's a third. Roll through. Attack. Kenny going to off top, but Brian Danielson just has other plans. Danielson tried to send them off again. Kenny hits a slap. Up top he goes. Drop kick. And Brian doing the no symbol. Kenny raising up the two sweets. Oh, what a forearm. Kenny kips up and hits that punch maneuver there. 
Oh, what an answer, Gary. Kenny, double act handle. Oh, what a forearm caught Kenny Ru while he was running again, but what a kick Kenny responds with. And Kenny. A chop connects. Punch, no. Danielson counters it. Sends him up to the top. Now countered. Danielson now. Looking for a suplex. Omega able to get out of it and a chop block. Sends him down. And looking for something. Fisherman. Clothesline. One. Omega kicked out. Hear how loud the crowd are. Forearm. No, caught by Brian. Brian got caught there. Looking for a knee. Can you... Kenny might have been looking for that V trigger. This time the V trigger connects. And now, I think Kenny might be looking for something here. Trail of wall position. And I think Kenny might have something in mind. What a double foot stomp. Kenny is relentless. Land another knee. Here, after what Brian said, I would, I'm not surprised that he is being so aggressive. Back in a knee drop. Shooting star on the outside. Count of two. Kenny go, goes back. Now, Kenny gets him power bomb position. And he nails one. Gets Danielson up to the top. Oh. On the shoulder. Rolling through. Into that shooting star. And now, sends Brian into the corner. And now, what's he looking for here? Is this a superplex? Maybe. Yes, it is. Omega Danielson. On the rope. Sends him almost over the top, but Danielson able to counter, kick to the gut, and the gut buster. One, no. And Danielson hits that power slam type maneuver. And now, I think this might be a burning hammer, yes! Drops Kenny on his head. Now, looking on something on Omega, but Kenny's able to dodge the drop kick. Get, he's getting into the ring, and he's going with a V-trigger! 
gets him up. Could this be one winged angel? One, two, no! Danielson kicked out. He is the second person ever. Besides Omega himself to kick out. Of the one winged angel here. Omega stunned, turned around, Omega! Oh, he turned around just in time. Able to land the forearm. Omega seemed like a man possessed. Sends him down with a face buster. Shooting star press. A second shooting star press. A third shooting star press. A fourth shooting star press. Going for a cripple, oh no! Danielson got the knees up. Drop kick to the back of his head. And now, kick to the gut. Domino scratch. Kenny lands on top. Sends him into the corner. And now, What's she looking for? Hurricane Rana. Off the top. Omega. Danielson off the ropes. Caught himself and he lands a forearm. Another. And now Ducks under Pele kick. That bicycle kick from Danielson. One. Omega's in the ropes. Rope break. And Danielson combo and a forearm. Kick to the back live on TNT in our main event here tonight. Looking for a running knee. A running knee. And now, drags him away from the rope. And now, I think he's looking for the heel hook. The heel hook is in. The heel hook is in. The heel hook is in. But Kenny, punching. And he's able to get away. And he's able to break free. Limping in and it's a Gary. That's brutal. Kick to the leg of Omega, just attacking the legs. Omega countered. Off the ropes. Danielson and a drop kick. No counter. Clothesline. Another. Duck Thunder. Super kick. Omega V trigger and now I don't think he's done with Danielson don't think he's done off the ropes dragon suplex turns him around sets up for the one winged angel and now the fans want it one more time. He's gonna give it to him. I think he's doing like three different methods of it. And a third. That's different than the one he hit before because he started off with Danielson on his shoulders. Sends him into the corner. Massive punch. And I think he's looking for one more time. Yes! That avalanche hurricane Rana sets him up perfectly middle of the ring. Turns him around. No! Danielson able to counter. And Danielson. No! Omega able to counter. Omega! Sends him down into a shooting star. Doesn't go for the cover. Think he knows that he needs more. 
Live on TBS and TNT. Running at him and an elbow drop. Sends him onto the apron. Sends him into the ring. Omega. Runs Danielson up. Drop kick. Then Kenny Omega. He's done it all. Growing up the two sweets in a corner. Double axe handle. Not letting Danielson escape. Kenny stomping the boots. What's he looking for? Third V trigger. That could be the third. It might be the fourth. Turns him around. Gets him up. Surely now. No. Danielson counters. Danielson counters. Now, Danielson looking for something. Drops him on the knee. To the face. Might have been looking for a label lock. Omega countered. Omega countered. And I think now's his chance. Now's his one and only chance. Looking to deliver the one winged angel. Danielson days. And he hit it. One. Two. And Omega gets it done. And one of the greatest matches of all time. There is finally a winner. And that is the best belt machine. Kenny Omega proving that he is the greatest wrestler that is currently on earth. Or at the very minimum, in that AEW locker room. Kenny Omega is your victor here in Phoenix. In one of the greatest matches of all time. Alright, that's it for today's episode of the Wrestleverse.